Good morning, I'm Kalina Estrinos and right now in your 13 Action News update. Starting today, elementary schools will return to in-person learning five days a week, while more high schoolers will start hybrid learning. Now, some parents are thrilled to see their kids go back, while others say the new schedules will create challenges for some families. Superintendent Jesus Jara says district leaders want remote learning to remain an option for parents next school year. The Gaming Control Board is taking a major stance in the fight against COVID-19. The board telling casinos if they want capacity limits increased, they'll have to demonstrate they've taken steps to vaccinate their workers. On-site vaccinations have already been underway at Caesars Entertainment at the Rio and also at the Cosmopolitan. And today, Station Casinos will launch their on-site vaccination program. Heading to downtown will soon become a little easier. Desert Inn will be connected on the city's east side, making travel to downtown Las Vegas less of a headache. And taxpayer dollars will help pay for the project. This is expected to take a year to complete. Bit of a lingering wind from the north this morning and temperatures only in the 60s, but with any sort of a breeze, it'll feel a little cooler than you might think. The good news is that that wind is going to calm down midday through the afternoon. Fairly quiet stuff and we'll have sunshine temperatures only hitting the upper 70s. It's forecast of 78, more than a 10 degree drop or cool down from the weather the last three days. We're back in the 80s Wednesday, right on through the end of the week into the weekend, but clean up pretty benign forecast here other than a little breezy weather on Thursday looks good. All right, Justin, thank you. And that was your 13 action news update. You can find more on our website, ktv.com and our free mobile app.